always, thank you very much. Salam Apo for joining us here today. Uh, we really, really appreciate it. We know how busy your schedule is, and we know just how busy uh, your schedule is today, actually. So, um, uh, so thank you for coming. Um, I really think you guys have the best job, right? You guys, whether you're bloggers or media, you follow, you get the opportunity to follow the best industry, I think, in a modern economy. The modern telecommunications industry is about giving customers access to the internet, access to what they want. It's a very exciting, a very exciting sector to be in. And you guys have front row seats to uh, not only an exciting sector, but as you guys know, exciting times within that sector. Uh, a couple of weeks ago, we did our uh, quarterly announcements, right? And we, uh, we announced that we, uh, we gained share for the fourth consecutive quarter. We're, we're on the front foot attacking. And somebody in this audience, I can't remember who it was, asked me, what do we have in store in terms of innovation on content and the digital space? And I told, uh, my answer was, well, well, I'm not here to talk about that today in the quarterly announcements, but stay tuned over the next couple of weeks. Well, here we are, just three weeks later, and this is what it's about. Before I jump into what exactly we're launching today, I think one of the key things you need to understand is how we think at Globe about the internet and how we think our content and digital strategy um, needs to evolve and how we think is different to how other guys think. And this time, I think we've got it very, very right. So the, the first key thing you've got to understand about our digital strategy is we believe in the cloud, not client applications. So for, for those of you who are, who are less, less attuned, what does the cloud mean? The cloud basically is the internet, right? And the cloud allows you to go and get information no matter what device you use, no matter what service you use. So, so we believe in the cloud. We don't believe that actually access to the internet and the information that you want should be restricted to a particular client device. So that's the first thing. And this is representation of it as we get into it today. The second thing is we don't believe going to the internet is device specific. Right? We believe actually everyone should go to the internet on their mobile device. And you shouldn't have to buy a new device to go to the internet and experience the joys of the internet. In fact, no matter what your device is, our job as a provider is to make it easy and simple for you, not to force you to buy a new device. And anybody who forces you to buy a new device is telling the customer to do something that they don't want to do or don't need to do. Right? The third thing we believe is that access to the internet and the things on the internet on your mobile should be free and easy. And you put all three of those things together. We believe in the cloud. We believe that it should not be about a specific device. And we, should, we believe that we should get the information as a provider to you on a mobile phone and make it free and easy leads to us today, which is the launch of M.Globe. So we're very excited. This is the most exciting thing I've actually uh, been a part of since I've been at Globe. Um, today we're launching M.Globe, right? And it's not... It's not a portal we'll be launching three weeks from now. It's available today. You can try it. Um, uh, so, and, and many of the uh, zombies around the room uh, will help you out uh, throughout the day and, uh, and after the event. So what is M.Clo? Quite simply, it's the internet made easy on your mobile and brought to you by Globe. So what does it allow you to do? Well, it's a one-stop shop where you can get all the information that you need. The most important information that many, many of our customers have and need is their prepaid balance or their postpaid bill balance. Right? We serve that up real time, free, right in front of you. But we know it doesn't stop with us. We know it doesn't stop with your prepaid balance. The most important thing that probably most of you deal with is Facebook or Twitter. So we provide your most recent updates, your most recent tweets on your wall for free. You can post directly to your wall from your M.Globe portal. We also provide access and setup for Hotmail or Gmail. So this is my particular portal, this is my prepaid phone. Um, uh, and it's hooked up and I can see on my Gmail I've got 392 new messages. <laughs> I live a pretty busy life. Um, uh, and then it doesn't stop there because we have access to exclusive content. Um, I'll talk a little bit of a, a little bit later about the content that uh, that that we have a little bit later today, 
Um, uh, so, uh, so all of that is in one place. All of that is accessible no matter what device you have. And you don't need to buy a new device. And you don't need to have a particular client application. Right? It's all right there in the palm of your hands, and we have it live, ready today. So enjoy, as you see around. So again, we believe in the cloud. We believe it should be available to every device. And we believe it should be free and easy, and that's what M.Globe is all about. So we didn't just stop there. Um, uh, we know that actually there's a lot of different operating systems out there, and there you can do a lot of very cool stuff with some of the operating systems. One of the operating systems, as the bloggers would know, is a popular one called Android. It's the Google operating system that operates a lot of phones. It allows you to do a lot of cool functionality on top of that. So what we did to make it even easier for Android customers, and again, irrespective of what phone you use, any Android customer, right? We've developed a, uh, a great little widget that sits on top. Well, this is my particular widget, right? And it serves up all the information that you need, again, in real time. And then you can click on it and go right directly to the portal. So right on your home screen is your Facebook posts, your prepaid balance. You can check your updates. You can actually go into an application and register for promos with one click. No more texting. No more, what's the keyword for the promo? No more, what's the key, what's, is it 8888 or 2223 or what is it? It's just click. I want only text. Click it and away you go. And that's, that makes the internet easy. So, that's a little bit of a, a, of a high level overview, right? I'll come back in a little bit and talk a little bit more, but, uh, but the, the man and the, the team behind it all is our digital media team. Uh, uh, I'm gonna toss it over to our host, I believe, to start off with, and then you can hear a little bit more about the details. But again, the key message, key takeaway, with Globe, every phone is a net phone. Right. <laughs> Wonderful. Oh, yeah. Simple. We actually have our designated zombies who will approach you for your queries. We have a Facebook and Twitter zombie. Raise your hand, Facebook and Twitter zombie. Where are you? Basta, oh, There you are. She's a very pretty zombie. We have also a check balance and Google zombie. Where is the check balance? <laughs> Ayan, ipig sabihin, you can approach them if you want to check your balance, if you want to Facebook, if you want to Twitter. And ladies and gentlemen, now to show you more features of M.Globe, on stage is Globe Telecom's head of portals, Rami, Rami de Villa. He's here. <laughs> Uh, good afternoon, everyone. I'm Romy. I'm a, a part of digital media and part of the team that developed the M.Globe. Uh, next, please. So, one of the things that, that we were, uh, when we were conceptualizing the M.Globe is, what do we want to focus on? Are we going to focus on features? Are we going to focus on being high-tech? What do we want to, to the proposition to be? I thought, it has to be easy. I mean, uh, I came from a design background, and uh, one of the things that we are really pushing in Globe is to make the services easy to use. So, I will be showing two screens of M.Globe, the one in the portal and the other one in the widget. So, going to the concept of being easy, there's just these are the four steps that you need to do in order to activate your portal. You open your browser, you go to the m.globe.com.ph, you enter your mobile number, and then you click the verification link. And that's it. You're ready to go and use the M.Globe portal. Okay. These are the screens that you'll see. Upon typing, you will be prompted to supply your mobile number. When you click on submit, you will receive an SMS verification. Why do we do that? Because we want to protect your, your uh, number. Because there are instances that probably gusto nyo nakuhin yung friend nyo, i-register nyo, but that can't happen. Only your number will be registered, and you will have to, rip, to use the verification code that we will send you via 2888. Okay? After you receive, after you verified your number, you will be redirected to another page. It asks for your Facebook or Twitter account. You log in there, you, log, you, you provide your, your 
your uh, username and password, and then that's it. You're ready to use the MDAT Go. Next, please. Uh, let me show you the screen. This is basically my account already. As uh, what Peter shown earlier, you'll see here your uh, account information, your Facebook and Twitter updates, your uh, RSS feeds, and also your emails. What you do is, when you post using the m.glow, it's not only posted on your portal, on your personal account. It's also posted on your social network account, specifically your Facebook and your Twitter. So when you visit the website, you will see there that you posted that update using the m.glow portal. Okay? So this is an example, a screenshot of, of the web. Next, please. One of the interesting uh, enhancements that we, that we introduced in the m.globe is uh, improving the search. So if you were talking about search, then we're talking about Google. So we, you, in, in m.globe, we're already using google.com. Uh, you could search for anything. The default results is the globe, information from the globe portal. But you could also do, it could also display pages coming from the internet in general. Okay, next. The good thing about the M.Globe is uh, the services are connected. For example, if we, we, we have a service, if, you're, if you could read that, we share. We share is, uh, is designed to allow users to browse. Because the, alam nyo naman, the problem with mobile is you don't know the URL. So you have to ask your friend, ano ba address ng, ng website, ng website. In the internet, it's easy. But in the mobile, it's difficult. That's why we, we, we conceptualized a service and implemented WeShare. WeShare is, if you have an interesting mobile site, you put it in the portal, and others will be able to see it in a directory of interesting URLs. So, when you do a recommendation of a certain site, when you do a recommend, it appears in the WeShare, and also, you could also share it in your Facebook and Twitter. So services like we share is integrated with Facebook and Twitter as well. Okay? So that's the portal side. So you follow the four steps. You verify your number. You associate a Facebook or Twitter account and that's it. Uh, there are a lot of information you could post to Facebook, to Twitter. You could read your emails. You could reply to your emails. You could recommend an interesting uh, website or website all in the portal. Now. We didn't stop there. We created a, an extension of the portal, which is the widget. Just like the portal, you only need four steps. You download it, you install the application, the installer, you add the widget on your home screen. How do you add the widget? Are you anyone familiar here with widgets? So, ilulong press lang po natin yung screen and then sabihin sa inyo, add widget. And then you look for the m.globe widget. And then, you enter your mobile number again. And then the, end, the verification code. Next, please. So this is how it looks like. After you've downloaded, the m.glow will be part of the list of the widgets available for you. You install it. It will ask for uh, the verification of your number. And then it will send you a verification code. Verification code is important for us for, for security reasons. Okay? Next, please. This is how it looks like. Uh, it's an active screen. Okay, some of the widgets or some of the applications are, you know, nandudun lang sa home screen, walang ginagawa. This one is a very active widget. So, you can see here, this is dynamic. The upper part of the widget is dynamic. It changes depending on the updates that you receive. Sometimes, it will display your Facebook update. Sometimes, it will tell you the new emails that you have. Sometimes, it will tell you new news from your RSS feed without doing anything. And also, uh, we implemented a cute mechanism that, that will tell you that there's something new in your account. These are blue by default, but it, if it has something new, it changes to red. So it tells you that there's something new. Next. Tasks are simple, very basic. We don't want to confuse the user with a lot of features. I mean, the Android itself is already a feature-rich phone. And we don't want to be redundant. I mean, we don't want to, to overload the application and the widget with a lot of features. So we just selected what are the most, the, the most relevant and the, the most relevant features. 
So you could check, you could subscribe to promos.